a critical right now. Which means, yeah, most likely a book release, unless there's something about the warrants, like a no bail or something. I don't know. Go for it. It's fine. Literally, I'm going like, right past Walgreens. Right past Walgreens, huh? Okay. Just letting you know, too, I got a video camera on me. It's recording, alright? How come? How come? Because they're, they're making us wear these now. Not everyone yet. Really? Yep. I'm sorry, that's I don't know, what do you think? Should we wear cameras? <laughs> so where are we running from? Not too far of a ride. Sunday night at one o'clock in the morning. You got nowhere to be Monday morning? You got a job or anything? No. I got hit by a car like two years ago, and I'm like a prime candidate for disability. I need to get, like, in. Disability? What's hurt you? I have really bad memory. Like, my memory's all fucked up. Hmm. It's in a coma burning half when I got hit by a car. Really? Where'd that happen at? Um, on this night in And were you on a bike or were you walking or what? I was on a bike. Do you have a helmet on? No, and you don't have a helmet on right now? Sorry. Jeez. No lights either? I don't know what the lie is on the bike. Uh, like, I don't even ever ride, ride a bike. I was just riding the helmet. Yeah, here in uh, the city of Spokane, you need a helmet at all times and a light up front Just one light, you gotta need a headlight and then you need a reflector on the back Like most cops. Like most cops. Ooh, that's not good. Most of them out here are really good. Hmm. Am I going to become an asshole if I take you to jail, though? Probably. Probably. <laughs> if I don't get booked in the league.
Alright, I gotta take you. Yeah. Healthy side? Yeah. So, just gonna walk over to my car. Yeah, there's some misdemeanor warrants. Like I said, yeah, as long as it doesn't sound like anything is a DV, but I think only if there's like a no bail or certain things like that. Yeah, there's like a misdemeanor warrant for you for something like that. Yeah, I think only if there's like a no bail or certain specification on it, but usually those are pretty, okay. pretty rare, okay? You got a lot of stuff? Here. Alright, put your hands behind your back. Is there anything in your pockets at all? Sorry, these turns are really tight. I don't think there's anything in there. Is there anything in the bra or anything like that? Mm -hmm. They're going to find a jail. Mm -hmm. Okay. I got something yesterday. There's a name in there. Okay. He just wanted to know if his wife and kids were oh, well, I think it's Okay, very good. I will uh, let them know we've done all we can do for them. Appreciate that. Retention or custody? One in custody, get those warrants over. What's up? It's all right. From the academy. Oh shit, really? Everybody else is it's not like on their break or in the break. So I was. That's <laughs> why. <laughs> <I'm> like. I don't know, she was definitely just trying to evade me. To the chick? Yeah. I think she's a chick. But I don't know if she like pulled something out of her. But yeah. Uh, no. Not too old. Like the hair. But uh, she rode by me and then I stopped her and she's like, Can I just go? Can I just go? No, I'll get a helmet. And, you know, doing that whole thing. And I was like, Oh, oh no, I guess not. So, alright. Maybe. Alright, thanks, man. Alright, sorry. No problem.
Yeah, both of them are for theft. Yep. One is a theft third, and one is a city theft. Uh, we'll find out at the jail. Step third, same thing for the most part. One is just a state charge, one's a city charge. Does it say, like, um, no. On the warrant itself, it will, though. Four six one's coming on scene. Can you call for shoplifting or anything? Okay. Have you got caught for shoplifting or anything? Okay. Could be that. Refusing to take his meds, also threatened to kill the complainant. So we born in 97, currently in his own bedroom. 2214 East Hartson. Six of a copy, can you count? Two, three, David, 377. I'll go for it. 423 is first. 23, that's okay, I'll go in case there's paper. We can get off on time. Okay. Four five three. Four five three. Phil State, see if they want to do it. I don't think twenty four on scene. Can I get a case number? 
Okay, LO220 Chicago as well. Call 310. Right. And would you be able to start for Lincoln and Mallon? 453's requesting that corporal there in Lincoln and Mallon. Coming Newport Highway and uh, Walmart. Three fifteen. Three fifteen. I'm three four thirty eight PM. I've got him here on the southeast side. Alright, see what the female for Cody. Right, female. Hey, uh, despite what was uh, discovered last night also. Go ahead. I will need a shield here to work with him, a graveyarder, please. Adam 423. Adam 423. I'm out with a right striker here on Sprague and around Medelia. I'll give you a plate here. Adam, Sam, and Henry 2934. Charlie 367. What's that? What's up? No, 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 you. It's with your arm. Bursitis. The swelling or the inflammation of the sack that moved the mover cage your elbow. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> It's fucking annoying. My elbow, my elbow will swell out. Oh, well, how'd that happen? I don't know. Is that like contagious or something? No. What's your ear for? Warrant. Come on, this is your warrant. Alexander Rausch. No, I got Stan. You don't want to sit on it. No. <laughs> you don't want to sit there. Oh. All right. Like I said, two warrants, one out of the county, one out of the city. Oh, let's see, the county one is going to be for theft third and obstruction. Bail is 7550 for a failed appear for hearing September 24th by Judge Durr or Durr or whatever. And a court date on September 24th? That's the one that, that's when it was issued. Okay. And then the city one, looks like you got two counts of theft and two counts of trespass in second. $2,400 on that one, failed appear for hearing. That was September 5th. This one was issued by Judge Stewart. Uh, Division of Lacrosse. So those are both old ones from the Supreme Court date? From September this, this month, fairly new. 
And they're both uh, yeah, from the beginning. Of one from January and one's from May. Oh. Eleven something, isn't it? You remember? Eleven thirty-six. I can't remember. I know. Both are jail withdrawals. I don't know. You hate from here just as much as I do. <laughs> it's always too freaking hot in here for me. Especially in the winter. But down here, it's fucking freezing in the winter. It doesn't help if you guys got an air away. Yeah. Going into the jail books and the couch, it's sweating. And then I found out I had got it under control. And I was like, oh, we're good to go. And I started to. Lifted on Thursday night. Hmm. You know, Friday, my arms are swollen up again. I'll probably have to go on my duty here soon because I got a stress fracture in my foot. I don't do that. Just overuse. Probably a lot of running and crap and shoes. Yeah. I'm going to some dinner. Yeah, these are brand new. I hate them just like a little bit. Yeah, they're not the best. I got them for free though. Pair of boots and you got some good insoles in there, but you got, you got super good ones or what's that? What's insoles? Yeah, uh, someone gave them to me. They just have a good, nice arch in them. Yeah, that's good like green or orange or, or blue. Yeah, super deep. I like the uh, I use the orange ones. Mm. The only one one pair of Danner is the uh, striker ones, yeah, but they don't. So. Which ones you got, the Arcadia? Uh, mine are the Recon. They've got a little bit of insulation in them. Yeah. And they're full leather, too. So you've got a wash for boots. Uh, Amazon, right around Black Friday time. Really? Right. I got these and a pair of. The super feed insoles for 190 bucks. And these boots are only 300 bucks. Yeah. yeah. That's the Black Friday on the Amazon. Black Friday. Yeah, Alexander, you got an address. Is that 6616 North Addison where you can get mail at or you get mail somewhere? How much does it cost to resold those ones? You're I've right. never resold them because I was going to do a complete rebuild on my. These are my second pair. I was going to do a complete rebuild on my first pair and I was going to send them to Danner and have them do it and it was going to cost like a hundred and something because mm -hmm. they replaced the liner inside and everything. But you can get them resold for like 50 bucks, I think. I mean, they just well, last me like. My other pair lasted me five and a half years. It's nice having a little bit of insulation and I like the full leather part so you're not worrying about Get stuck. shit stuck in there. Yeah, or but with bloodborne issues. Yeah. That's what I was told. If I have a pair of the I have three pairs of dinners, I have my old one, old pair. I have a pair of their super light minimalist boots, tachyon. So they're great for like running like obstacle course in. Oh. There's nothing to like they're they're lighter than my tennis shoes. Huh. And they have a good pair of insoles in them and they're even more they're more comfortable than my tennis shoes, but I don't wear them in here because they have no water resistance to them at all. And it's not very often you have to go Usually sell it full of water, but I've gone into one that had water up to the um, to the bed. Nice. Hey, Crofty. Yo. Did you look at Bosch's junk? A little bit. Okay. With the peeling or anything? I don't think so. No chemical burn. It doesn't look like it. It looks oh. like a normal 
Thank you. You're welcome. What was the dude was running around downtown beating off? What? <laughs> What'd you hear about a call yesterday, the suicidal guy that... Oh my god, the other day I'm coming out of Holy Family Hospital out of the ER. This dude asked me if I need a ride. I get in his car, or his truck, it's like a monster truck. He had already had his pants down, and he's jacking off, and he's watching people go in and out of the entrance of Holy Family Hospital. And this is previous to him knowing I was even in there or that I was there. So this dude is so creepy as to like be going around the parking lot, watching people go in and out and jacking off. I wonder who that could be. Who does that? What's it in there? Is it what's out? What's it no, I was just wondering who came in earlier. What hospital was he at? It wasn't that hospital. They just went around downtown. <laughs> yeah, dude, I got a uh, zip tie. Stuck around. Did you sharpen any dog. That's real hair or whip? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I know. Have to take a look at it. Make sure you're not smuggling anything in the water. No, thank God. <laughs> Turn in bakes for walk. A little cold water remedy. Sharpen any pockets. Well, I mean, you're here for the warmth. Well, like trying to like. You ever keep like a rubber band? No. I think he was like threatening to cut it off, and he thought that I was like a tourniquet or something. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> that takes a while. Dude. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Can we go inside and take the cuffs off? Mm -hmm. Keep your hands where I can see them and find the check to it. Okay. Do you need to talk to her about anything else? No. no. I just need to put her in the computer and go out and do the paperwork. So that's why.